stations and cable systems of your area. Emergency alert system equipment that can quickly warn you during emergencies is being tested. If this had been an actual emergency, such as a tornado, flood, evacuation, toxic release, or any emergency that you, the public, should be timely alerted, official messages would have followed the alert tone. This station serves as a vital part of the Louisiana State Emergency Alert System. This concludes this test of the Emergency Alert System. This is a weekly test of the NorWeather radio warning alarm device and the emergency alert system. During potentially dangerous weather situations, specially built receivers are automatically activated to warn of the impending severe weather and or hazards for the Florida Panhandle, Southeast Alabama, Southwest and South Central Georgia. Tests of these receivers are normally conducted every Wednesday between 11 a.m. and noon local time. When there is a threat of or existing severe weather in the area on Wednesday, the test is postponed until the next available non-severe or non-hazard day. Reception of this broadcast and the warning alarm will vary at any given location. To provide the most consistent warning service possible, the warning alarm will be activated for watches and warnings affecting the Florida Panhandle, Southeast Alabama, Southwest and South Central Georgia. This concludes the weekly test of the NOAA Weather Radio Warning Alarm and Emergency Alert System for the entire county warning area serviced by the Tallahassee Weather Forecast Office. This is a weekly test of the NOAA Weather Radio Warning Alarm device and the Emergency Alert System. During potentially dangerous weather situations, specially built receivers are automatically activated to warn of the impending severe weather and or hazards for the Florida Panhandle, Southeast Alabama, Southwest and South Central Georgia. Tests of these receivers are normally conducted every Wednesday between 11 a.m. and noon local time. When there is a threat of or existing severe weather in the area on Wednesday, the test is postponed until the next available non-severe or non-hazard day. Reception of this broadcast and the warning alarm will vary at any given location. To provide the most consistent warning service possible, the warning alarm will be activated for watches and warnings affecting the Florida Panhandle, Southeast Alabama, Southwest and South Central Georgia. This concludes the weekly test of the NOAA Weather Radio Warning Alarm and Emergency Alert System for the entire county warning area serviced by the Tallahassee Weather Forecast Office. The civil authorities have issued a fire warning for Lassen CA, beginning at 8.29 p.m. Thursday, September 9th and ending at 8.29 p.m. Friday, September 10th. New evacuation warnings have been issued for the following areas. West of but not including Boyd Springs Road southwest of the Lassen County line, River Flat Reservoir area west of Boyd Springs Road and Little Dotty Road check the status of your address at community.zonehaven.com All other evacuation orders and warnings remain in effect. Safety message. People under evacuation order should leave immediately. Those under warning who require assistance and those with pets and livestock should leave now. Use caution. Drive with your headlights on and yield to emergency personnel. Call dispatch for assistance evacuating 530257-6121. An emergency shelter is located in Bernie at the World of Life Assembly Church. Call 530-251-8128 for shelter information. Large animals can be taken to the Lassen County Fairgrounds. Deputies will be going door-to-door -to, -door to make notifications.